All right, y'all, Water God TV, we back with another video. Y'all know how we do. We pushing health, wealth, and a better understanding of self. So check it. We got Ice Cube and Elon Musk, right? Ice Cube been getting a lot of flack for him dealing with Elon Musk. Now, you know, on this show, I talk a lot about politics. I talk a lot about, you know, the black culture. I talk a lot about us, you know, moving forward. Okay, we're trying to push ourselves forward. And it's hard in our community and our culture to talk like this because when you try to change or when you try to do things, you're going to have to fight with your own people. Now, I'm a big fan of Ice Cube. I don't know if he got, you know, I don't know if he's just making a business decision. To me, I, there's not too many platforms that he can go on, in my opinion. That, you know, he can have his big three play to be looked at as not he doing business with white supremacy. I think any way you look at it, you know, you're going to be able to say he doing business with white supremacy. In my opinion, though, I could be wrong. Hey, I am a big fan of Cube. I could be wrong. I'm not going to sit up here and lie, but let's go over some facts, right? So this is the deal, right? On Twitter. Right, Ice Cube put, and I'm gonna share this so y'all can see it. Okay, Ice Cube put. Somebody wrote, somebody wrote Ice Cube. Excuse me. Somebody wrote Ice Cube and put. Um, I respect your response, but just look and see who Elon connects himself to, and tell me I'm wrong. Okay. Uh, I still have respect for Q, always will. However, I'm not blind to his whole, to who he aligned with. I like the big three. Both things can be right at the same time. Q, bro. Shut your feet up. I ain't trying to curse y'all, you two. I ain't aligned with nothing, punk. I draw my own line. Okay, and that was being nice, okay? But then people on here, they were saying... Did anyone else read this in Cube's accent? They also put people who think Elon Musk is racist also think mayonnaise is racist just because it's white. So, you know, they said people want Elon and X to fail so bad that they hate it when they make good collaborations because that means the platform has life. So it's a lot of people saying... They on Cube side. Some think Cube is a um he a sellout now. And I, don't, I never seen Cube as a sellout. But maybe I could be wrong. You know? But this one is funny. This comment they said. Oh. One of you guys just threw this at me? Oh, shit. Oh, why are you throwing this gross on me? Yo, he's just a mannequin. He's just a mannequin. So, uh, this is one of the comments that you put on somebody. That was crazy. But, you know, when I look at this, he getting the big three on one of the platforms. I don't see it as a bad thing. I don't know. You know, but sometimes, you know, in the community, it's hard to please the community and the culture, man. I'm telling you, you know, whatever you do can seem like you, you crossing over, you know, and, um, I probably, you know, have did some of that too, the to people, but Ice Cube swiftly addressed, I'm going to go into some authoritation. Ice Cube swiftly addressed a fan's accusation of being aligned with the white supremacy, notably Elon Musk, following a recent update about the Big Three League. So on Thursday, uh, rapper Ice Cube uh, took to X from the Twitter to deliver a high, highly anticipated news on the comeback of his three-on-three -three pro basketball league, which is set to kick off its seventh season on June 15th. X why the league isn't on on the streaming platform rumble cube replied because we're on x better ask somebody 
So the former NWA rapper answer faced criticism from fans who questioned his decision to do business with Elon Musk, whom he presently who who he previously clashed with, casting doubt on Cube's intentions. So uh yeah, man, um it was just, you know, I'ma read y'all what people are saying uh about Ice Cube in the comments on him. Yeah. So they saying um the big three got funded through a white supremacist. So Q been in the bed with them. He sold out a long time ago. Some dudes don't care as long as they can go home to a gated communities with the money they make with. Them. That's a low blow there. I mean, we don't know if it's I mean, uh you know. I'm going to say it again. I'm a big fan of Cube. I always, you know, I like his music. He was one of the first artists I listened to. I think it was Too Short. And it was E4. I mean, um, Ice Cube. So, you know, I may be biased in this situation. But me, I feel like he just trying to trying to do business. He got to do business with somebody. It was either <clears throat> um, the other platform. I mean, pretty much all the white guys on the platforms. Last time I checked. So it's like, I don't know. You know what I'm saying? So I want to know what y'all think. Now, do you think just because he, uh, Ice Cube put his Big 3 Basketball League is going to be seen on X, formerly known as Twitter, does this have to make Ice Cube look like he's aligning himself with white supremacy? Okay, because I don't see it. You know, I just see a brother trying to get some, you know, trying to make moves with his lead. That's how I see, that's how I see it. But he's getting a lot of flack for just doing business with Elon Musk. A lot of people don't like Elon Musk. Um, I'm just finding out, you know, he's he, he, he's white supremacist. You know, I, I never knew that. I just thought he was, he made Tesla, he was a businessman and he bought Twitter, you know. I never knew that, you know, he aligned himself and he was white supremacy. But, I mean, that's what y'all are saying. We'll, I got to get some more evidence of that. But um, wherever Big 3 or Ice Cube was streaming his platform off of, I would just hope him success and wish him, you know. I'm pretty sure if Ice Cube can get his own stuff, he would do that. He seems like that type of guy to me that, you know, he's just trying to. He's just trying to do business and push his product on the streets, you know? And I don't think there's nothing wrong with picking somebody to do business with, all right? Now, Twitter can get a little wild. I, I wasn't, I mean, I'd be looking at some stuff that's on Twitter and I'd be like, wow, but I don't think it's Elon Musk. It's like people that's on there. Right, I didn't see how the platform was before I, a little bit, but I didn't, I couldn't really, you know, I wasn't really into Twitter, so I can't be the judge of that. But let me know what y'all think in the comment section, man. Is Ice Cube a sellout for doing this, man, or are they reaching? Let me know what you think, man, and make sure y'all help me get to 3,000 uh, subscribers, man. Push me on the algorithm, hit that like button, man, comment. Do your boy solid. I'll catch y'all in the next video. Peace and love. Make sure you get your free water test at Envirely.com. Here we got Mr. Pollock. He had a cornfield. He took advantage of a free water test from us. And this is what we found in this water. We found sulfur. We found hardness. And we solved this problems with an easy fix of two tanks. So get your free water test today. Stay blessed. Click the link below.